What's good YouTube, is now 1337 aka Snow here today with a gameplay of me using the MTAR X on the map Favela. Now it starts off pretty bad but I'll pick it up at the end of the map. Not a brilliant gameplay, just the gameplay. And I'm using an SMG because today we are doing the top 5 most wanted SMGs from myself that should appear in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now I started this series last week with assault rifles. If you did not see that video, check the video description, there will be a link to it. And SMGs are probably my favourite type of weapon, so this is a really a really hard picked top 5 for me because there's so many SMGs that I like. But I figured I would go around with the basis of what everyone would want, so let's get into it anyway. In at number 5 we have the PPSH from pretty much any Call of Duty, but I'm going to go with the one from World at War. Now this gun was an absolute animal to be a PSG. A PSG, an SMG, what did I say PSG? Um, an SMG, it is ridiculously overpowered. Um, lack of recoil in some of the Call of Duty games, like the original Call of Duty games with the PPSH. Um, it had a barrel drum, so it had a extra ammo as well. So it was just literally an absolute animal and the fire rate was pretty decent. So I would like to see an iteration of a PPSH come back, a, a round drummed ammunition case on an SMG but obviously not as ridiculously overpowered as the PPSH was in any of the games it appeared in. Definitely a badass SMG and definitely should return because it hasn't really been in a lot of Call of Duty. So that's my number five spot. In at number four, we have Modern Warfare 2's P90 SMGs. Now these guns were just a tank, especially when you had them akimbo. It was just on fair but the reason why i love this gun is the way it sounds the way it takes a certain level of skill if you play with it as a single p90 like it has some recoil that you have to battle against but also it looks different it looks unique it looks cool it sounds cool and it is just an awesome smg and one of my fav personal favorites ever but it only gets number four in my list because i believe these top three ones will be wanted by the majority in at number three, we have the MTAR X from Call of Duty Ghost. Now, I do not like Call of Duty Ghost the game, but this SMG is by far my favourite gun in the game. It is so, just so nice to use. It feels fluid. It run, you can run with it um, pretty fast. Like there's no drawback to the gun in my opinion. It has a little bit of recoil, but if you know how to control it, you can actually use this gun more like an assault rifle. And if you watch the pro players use an MTAR, it is ridiculous. And it doesn't lose too much damage at the drop-off point when you put a silencer on it. So it's 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 just essential to use if you want to run around gunning. I don't think there's another SMG in the game which even comes close. Maybe the Ripper, but I just don't like the Ripper because it's a it's a hybrid gun. I hate it. So MTAR X. Definitely worth getting into a top 5 for SMGs in my opinion. And it got into number 3. In at number 2 we have Modern Warfare 3's MP7. Now this gun was an absolute tank. It was so powerful. It was so cool looking. And it was like... um, It's like the epitome of an SMG. Really, really small but awesome and powerful like a little cannon. Um... Just a phenomenal gun. Absolutely loved it. Got so many mobs with this gun. And it is probably one of the best SMGs in history. If not one of the best guns in Call of Duty history, to be honest. I would put it up that high. But for me, it gets number two. And last but definitely not least, in at number one, we have Black Ops 2. Can you guess what the gun is? Of course, it's the MSMC. Now, the MSMC, in my opinion epitomizes what an SMG should be. You have good maneuverability with it. The recoil isn't too much, like it, 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 it barely has any, but it does take skill to use and utilize the weapon properly. You can use it from range if you know how to just trick, feather the trigger. Um, absolutely just phenomenal. I love this gun. One of my favorite guns in Call of Duty history, apart from maybe the MK14. Um, especially on PC. PC it's just nothing but hip fire. You put a laser sight on it and all you have to do is hip fire and it's so, so satisfying to use. That's the word I'm looking for. It is the most satisfying gun to use in my opinion. You feel like you're earning your kills. You feel like you're having enjoyment and fun from using a gun. 
So definitely, definitely my number one spot. But that is the countdown done for today. Let me know what you think about my top five. Let me know what SMGs you would want to see in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare from old Call of Duties. Or if you want to bring up other ones that you know, which I haven't been in games, bring those up too. Let me know what you think about my list. Drop some comments, some likes, some support, some faves, subscribes, and all that good stuff. Check out the video description for last week's episode, including assault rifles. But that's me done for today. Peace out. Take care.